I have a, a 2012 Honda Civic 1.8 liter here. Now the customer come in with the code um, fuel system too lean. So right away, um, it's, a, it's a vacuum leak code. So right away I looked at it, I can see that the air box tube is ripped right there. So um, I wanna find out some more, see if there's any rips anywhere or could be dirty mass airflow sensor, could be dirty air filter. Uh, of course, I'm gonna replace the air boot. So for right now, I'm gonna change that first and then uh, we'll find out if there's any other uh, problem. So on here, I'm buying the aftermarket parts. So this is the uh, part number right here. Uh, you can see it on here. And this is also the part number shows on there. And it's gonna cost uh, $20. So uh, to replace the boot, um, I uh, unhooked the uh, holes right here. And for this one, I just pull it straight out. Um, just remove whatever that's connected to the air boot. This one's a five millimeter bolt one right here and then there's another one in here where the throttle body is and uh, for the mass airflow you don't have to disconnect it if you want to take out the whole air box and clean it but uh, I'm also gonna uh, changing out the uh, engine air filter I'm gonna clean out whatever's in here and I'm gonna use the uh, mass airflow cleaner to clean out the sensor right here so for you to take out the box that's one bolt right here, one bolt on the side, which is down here, and I believe there's one in the back. Now here's the better view. That's a big rip right there. Now I'm just gonna put everything back to uh, original. You can see this air filter is really bad. Kind of dirty right there. And I bought a new one, fresh and clean. Now to make my life easier, uh, I put a little bit of grease around the lip so that way it slides in easier. So I got the air boot back in. Uh, for the uh, mass airflow sensor, you're gonna take out the screw right here and use the uh, mass airflow cleaner right here. So just spray it on the uh, sensor, take it out, spray it on the sensor, let it dry, uh, put it back, put the connector back, put the clip in the back back. Uh, everything is back, the holes. PCB holes right here also and I also put the tube back, new air filter and two screws holding the air box. So uh, the main reason why that code pops up is because either the air boot is broken, uh, dirty air filter, uh, bad mass airflow sensor or dirty mass airflow sensor. It's a vacuum leak. So when the air boot cracked, there's a vacuum leak. So it sucks in a lot of outside air into the engine. That's why I, I changed out the uh, engine air filter. Here, I'm gonna show you the code. So permanent cold fuel system too lean. Too lean means there's, a, uh, there's more air uh, than fuel, so which is vacuum leak. That's why the air boot is uh, ripped in the middle. As you can see, there's a check engine light right there. And I'm gonna clear it. Temporary, also the same code. clear it and that should be it so it's very uh, common issue with the Honda especially these kind of year uh, the air boot broken a lot so that's a really easy fix and uh, that's it to this video so leave a comment down below ask me anything you want to ask me uh, like share subscribe thank you guys